Hey guys, Melinda Prevatera, Petrelli Prevatera. And today I wanna to focus on a really important topic and it has to do with the statement, I don't have the money to get divorced, so I can't get divorced. Or what do I do if I have no money? So I really wanna start with this really basic understanding. Divorces cost money. It is going to cost you money to get divorced, period. Even the most basic divorce without an attorney, you're gonna pay for it. You're gonna pay for filing fees, you're gonna pay to um, have quadros or to split accounts. It costs money. So to me, somebody saying, I don't have the money to get a divorce or I don't have the money to afford an attorney is like saying, I can't get a job because I don't have a car. To me, it's an excuse. If you want this divorce, you have to find the money and we can help you with that. So to overcome that objection, the real question is, do you want the divorce? If the answer is yes, we will deal with the consequences of divorces cost money. So let's talk about how we're gonna get you access to funds. That's the conversation. And we can do that a few different ways. We can get you access to funds through asking for counsel fees, through filing for support, or asking family and friends. That's normally the first start. There's avenues to get you what you want. Just like if you don't have a car, so you say you can't have a job, there's other ways to get what you want. You take a bus, you take public transportation, you get a bike. If you want the divorce, we'll find you the money. It's your mindset on the issue. So if you have any questions on this topic, if you want a divorce and you're afraid that you can't afford it, reach out to us. Hire a lawyer, we'll help navigate these difficult topics. Melinda Prevatera from Petrelli Prevatera.